performance with compressed backup let's learn about it today hi there this is pinal davan welcome to another episode of sequel in the 60 second recently i published a blog post where i explain how to take compressed backup and restore it now lots of people ask me i need to talk about performance even there honestly and personally i do not think performance matters as much when we are talking about compressed backup but as all of you wanted to learn let's see this demonstration so on the screen left side i have a sql server management studio and on the right side i have my drive where i'm going to take backup now we will be taking both of these backups together here is compressed backup and here is uncompressed now let's select the statement and click on execute as the backups will be created they will be visible on the right side over here now backups are completed over here you can see there are two files the first one is compressed and second one is uncompressed the size difference between both of them is quite huge so if space is an issue you should definitely go with compressed backup now when we look at the time taken by compressed backup it's little bit more around 94 second and per second it was processing around 90 megabytes whereas when i look at uncompressed backup it has taken only 18.66 second and it has processed around 458 megabyte per second so if you want your backup to be super fast then go for uncompressed but if you want your backup in very small size you should go with compressed backup but that will take little bit more time now this is about taking backup what about restore let's check that out right away here are scripts for restoring from our compressed and uncompressed backup let's run both of them together just like previous case now backup restoration is just started backups are being restored now the restores are complete on the top we can see compressed backups restoration which took around 24 second and per second it processed around 350 megabyte and right following that we have uncompressed backups restore which took around 17 second and it processed around 497 megabyte per second so in simple words if you have your backup which is compressed it will take little bit more time to compress and store it as well as it will take little more time to restore it as well now as i mentioned earlier in this video i really do not care about performance of backup time as well as restore because that is one of your essential process for your system but due to any reason that is a primary criteria for your backup and restore then you should definitely opt for uncompressed backup well i would like to know your opinion in comment section over here and i'll see you soon in another episode of sequel in the 60 second and before you leave do not forget to subscribe this video